They're off in the Woody Stevens. And it's Cinco Charlie who comes out running on the lead. On the inside, ready for Rye, is sent along to challenge and competitive edge, who broke near the back of the field, is right there running in third now, a length and a half off the lead, and surrounded by classy class in March. The trailer is two weeks off, and two weeks off's only five lengths off the leader. The leader is ready for Rye. Cinco Charlie is second on the outside through a 22 and one opening quarter mile. Competitive edge sits third as the field races for the far turn. And then it's March on the inside, classy class three one in fifth. Two weeks off, coming under a ride from Javier Castellano at the rear of the field as they round the far turn. Ready for Rye. Cinco Charlie on the outside. These two, just a half length apart. Competitive Edge continues to be surrounded by March in Classy Class, and they went 45 flat for a half mile, and two weeks off, still at the back of the field as they come toward the top of the stretch. And it's Ready for Rye, turning for home in front. Cinco Charlie is second, and Competitive Edge is not going on today. Competitive Edge is last. Competitive Edge is dropping back and will finish off the board as Cinco Charlie pulls away. Cinco Charlie, but here comes March. Cinco Charlie and March on the inside. March comes up the rail. March, get it! Beat Cinco Charlie right on the money. Then ready for Ryan Classy Class. It's a dirty beat if you had the five Cinco Charlie, but March up along the inside gets the trip made the difference. Boy, Cinco Charlie was so game, and when he sees March coming, he tries to fight back, and their strides kind of locked up at the wire, but it did appear that March's nose was stretched out a little bit more at the finish. Yeah, I think the inside's going to get the bob here. Two, five, and it looks like the one is going to hold on for third. It's classy class. Just is fourth best and I'll tell you what competitive edge did not like Ooh, that was tight did not like a lot of dirt in his face he broke awkwardly and Johnny was trying to get him involved Meg just had nothing yeah when he got off a little poorly Johnny was on him to get up in there but he never looked comfortable yeah. Richie we thank you for joining us and have a good rest of your great rest of your Belmont Stakes Saturday uh, it was great guys thank you Richard Migliori from Naira will be back with much more here at Belmont Park